What is going on college basketball fans? Welcome back to another episode of South Florida Bulls Dynasty. We got a good game here today versus number 19 in the country, Louisville. And I I'm excited. We got another home game. We finally broke our three game losing streak against Seton Hall. Got a 22 point victory. And, and it seems we finally found the identity of this team, which is get some turnovers, get some transition points and really just rebound the basketball. I got some good feedback from you guys on this series, and I think what we're going to start doing is instead of doing two games per episode and uploading one of these episodes a week, we are going to do one game per episode and upload two South Florida Bulls video videos every single week. It will be easier for me to edit that way, and I think it will be better for you guys to enjoy and keep up with as well. So let's get into today's matchup against number 19, Louisville. All right, here we go. NCAA basketball on CBS today. This is the South Florida Bulls at home, 12 and 6 in the Sun Dome in Tampa, Florida against number 19, 11 and 5, Louisville. And their center is averaging 18 a game, but it's a good thing we have Obu Obu, who is a defensive force down low, and hopefully. We can hold their star in check there with Obu and Henny in practice. Henny Smith, he's been doing a, he's been doing pretty good in practice. He's been staying off uh, the alcohol, so so we're gonna try to increase his minutes as the sixth man more in this game and give him some more opportunities to to, to help this team a little bit more. Lost the tip off there, but that's okay. We need another win here to to extend our win streak to two here in the big east it'll be another good conference win that's a good uh help defense there by oh it was a great help defense by dom but their center already making an impact and it looks like louisville is going to press us so that'll be interesting to see how our team does against pressure and not been able to get anything offensively even though we're playing good defense what a crazy shot there Obu is getting dominated, but on the glass, able to pick up that board. And Dom Alvarez get us on the board. No good. Four minutes into this game, almost. Three and a half minutes into this game, and we have not scored a bucket yet. And that's going to be a 6 nothing lead for Louisville. Let's see if we can break this press. Break Barry for three in transition, and that'll get us on the board. Three and a half minutes into the game, and we finally get a bucket by Drake Barry, and that's a good defensive possession. That's a quick, quick miss by Louisville, and that's exactly what we want. An opportunity to run and transition and pick up the pace. There's a nice roll by Dom Alvarez. Put him on a poster, baby, and that's how we play South Florida Bulls basketball, baby. That is coach Danny's game plan get the ball in transition get turnovers get the rebounds off quick misses and, and get out in transition fast man that is what we do that is what we do and just like that it's a one-point game in the Sun Dome don't get caught reaching Seth don't get caught reaching oh my gosh they're getting so many offensive rebounds and the guard is finishing over Dom Another one, Drake. Another one from Drake Barry in transition. They better stop pressing because that's all day from the freshman walk on Drake Barry. Good board, Obu. They've been killing us on the boards. Dom in transition. Slow it down just a little bit. Seth Jarvis trying to get shifty. Mid range. Oh, what a shot by Seth. Let's go. 10 to 2 run here now after a slow start we're starting to get some momentum going drake with a tough finish over two people we're gonna call a timeout here i like the run i like the run team uh you know coach danny giving his little spiel here we need to stop giving them so many offensive rebounds i mean this is ridiculous guys learn how to block out and, and get some boards and just for that reason we're taking seth jarvis out and putting henny smith in at shooting guard or at small forward and we're going to put ricky cage at the point 
Drake Barry at the two. I was going to sub in, uh, out Drake for Henny, but Drake Barry has been lighting it up from three for us, so we want to keep him in for a little bit. Let's give Seth a break, and, and then let's also take out Obu since he can't get a board and put in the backup, Johnny Neal, and see if he can get some rebounds for us. So let's go. This is the lineup we're rocking with. Let's go. Clean out the glass, and let's pull away from this game, boys. Come on. Oh my goodness, what a drive by Louisville to tie it there. Johnny Neal. Let's go, way to break the press. What a find by Ricky Cage who subbed in for point guard. Great defense, Ricky. Great defense, Ricky. Come on now. Come on now. Can't score on Ricky Cage. What a steal! Let's go. Penny Smith on the fadeaway mid-range. He has been killing it since he got oh, again since he got away from the bottle, man. He got away from the bottle. He's been killing it. What a shot by Henny, who is deserving of these minutes. And then he gets a rebound. Let's go, Henny. Make a pass down to Dom in transition. Ah. Oh. Stay on him, Henny. You've been doing so great in your AA meetings. Coach is proud of you. And a terrible miss. A terrible miss by Louisville. We're going to have an opportunity in transition here. Out to Drake in the corner. 4-3. Nothing but net. And Drake Barry has 11 in the first half of this one. And is 3-for-3 three three from behind the arc. Uh-oh. They're starting to make a little bit of a run here before the half. Just dump it off to Henny. Gets his own rebound and gets blocked. No. Three seconds till the half. Whew. Okay, they didn't make that three. We got a good seven-point lead at halftime over the number 19 team in the country. I'm very proud of what this team has been able to do at this point in the game. Uh, we've been doing a better job rebounding ever since I had to get on him a little bit. And ever since then, we've had a pretty comfortable lead. So we need to keep it up in the second half. Let's not let them get on any big runs. Let's limit their runs, limit their star player, which is their center. Continue to rebound and get transition buckets, and we'll be ready to win this game. So let's go, man. On. Henny with the mid-range. Let's go, Henny. Come on. From the mid-range again. Let's go, Henny Smith. Let's go. Let's go, Dom, in transition. Get your own board. They can't stop you, Dom. They can't stop you, Dom. Especially not when you're coming off of a big rest and you can, can get your own rebound. Oh no, they definitely can't stop you. Big rebound by Henny. Pushing the pace. Shot fakes. Faking it. Let's go, Henny. Post him up. Post him up, Henny. Post him up, Henny. What a move! No! That's okay. We can tell you've been working. We can tell you've been working. That was a good up and under. You just got to finish it next time, man. Just got to finish it next time. Henny with another basket. Henny Smith having a career day. Really wants his starting job back. He really is fighting for it. And Drake Barry fouled and gives them an and one. That's a big shot for Louisville. Because they are down by 13 right now. They can cut it to 12. Out on the right wing. Henny for three. Oh my gosh! Henny from downtown! Oh! I can't believe it! I can't believe it! I can't! 
cannot believe it. Henny is having himself a game. Oh, and the press by Louisville forces a turnover. Myth. He hit a deep three. And he can he could not shoot. I mean, he was too drunk. He was always seeing three baskets. I mean, there may be some locker room drama coming between him and Drake Barry for that spark, that starting spot. And a great pass by him down to Dom Alvarez. What an assist. And great rotations by Louisville. And they get a block. Obu throws up a prayer. That's not going to fall, but we drained a lot of clock in that possession. Oh, and they missed. Okay, we should be good to steal this game now. Seth Jarvis, and one! Let's go! And that is the icing on the cake. We get our second win in a row, both coming at home here in the Sun Dome. And this one against a ranked Big East opponent. And let's go. We got to continue the win streak next episode against Rutgers on the road. That is going to be a very hard environment to play in. But if we can beat Rutgers, I think we might be ranked at this point. What a great pass. Oh, my gosh. That was beautiful. Beautiful ball movement right there. Gotta love it. Good finish by Obu. Finish that play. They're gonna shoot a three. And I think they've only hit like one three the whole night. And probably so. They only have 32 points. Obu. Oh! <laughs> Dunks on their star center. Their center averaging 18 and 11. And Obu just manhandled him down on the block. Oh, what a three by Louisville. That's going to help their score look a little bit better. They're looking like Louisville in real life right now, man. Not like the 19th ranked Louisville in this game. Obu with another big dunk. We're finding him. This is how we break the press right here. We're getting some good experience against the pressure. And all three times in a row, Obu has gotten a big time bucket down low to finish off the break and that is going to do it for this one we can dribble it out and what a game in this one we're going to let ricky cage shoot it now drake barry's going to shoot it from deep and he hits it at the horn why not let's go <laughs> and that'll get us above 50 points as well player of the game for us was Obu. I did not realize, but ever since that timeout where I said, do not let Louisville keep getting these offensive rebounds, Obu said, all right, I got you, coach. And he was on a mission. He got 14 boards tonight and played a great game. And I got to give my player of the game personally as a coach to Henny Smith. Look at him hit that fadeaway right there in the replay. He hit a deep three today. I'm so proud of that man, Henny. It, it almost makes the coach want to cry, man. Uh, because he could very well be the final piece, if he stays sober, of this team. Look at him. He had 13 points today, 5 rebounds, 2 assists. Woo! He had 7 turnovers, though. We're going to have to work on that a little bit there, Henny. But he's definitely made a case to possibly take back his starting spot in, in spot of Drake Berry here. I'm so proud of Henny Smith, man. Both of these small forwards are freshmen, and they want to battle it out for their spot on this team that, that's looking like they're going to make a run time, uh, come March Madness. So that is going to do it for this episode. Make sure you guys stay tuned because I believe we have Rutgers on the road. Let's see if we can continue our win streak with a tough – road team and, and uh keep this season going strong so thank you guys so much for watching i'm out